Hi everyone, this is Lauren of Makeup by Lauren Ann, and today I'm going to show you how to achieve this old eyebrow look with only three things. That's right, three things! You're only going to need e.l.f. defining eye sh brush, a glue stick, and you don't need this palette, but you do need a pure white eyeshadow. That's all you need for this whole look. Well, not this whole look, not like the eyeshadow or lips or anything, but for the um, making your eyebrows look aged or old, um, that's all you need. It's really fast and simple. I even do both the eyebrows in the video. That's how fast it is. Really easy and really fun, and yeah, I hope you enjoy this look. Okay, so I've zoomed in, and first I'm going to apply this Elmer's Washable school glue stick and this is a purple one but it dries clear you can also use a white one if you'd like so we're just gonna apply it on the whole eyebrow I'm gonna do both eyebrows and it is a wet feeling and kind of not really sticky but maybe a little and does make your eyebrows look a little darker, I think. Okay. So there we go. That's done. You will start to feel them be like, you know, weird when you do that. Okay. Um, next, all you need is a white eyeshadow, pure white eyeshadow. So I'm going to go to my nifty Coastal Scents 88 color eyeshadow palette. This is the matte one. And you open it up, and I'm just going to take this white right here. I'm going to use my e.l.f. Professional Defining Eye Brush. You can even see that. And it has this kind of slanted look. You can already tell I use it. Um, and it's not a total compact brush. Um, it's um, kind of... I mean, it's not the best quality, but you really don't need, you know, an $80 brush for this. So just dip in your eyeshadow, take a good amount, tap off excess, and here we go. Watch the transformation. Apply as much as you want for the coverage and the look that you are trying to achieve. Look at that. In my opinion, I look so much older with those eyebrows right now. Like, compare them. So I'm going to do the other one now. And before you even start, I forgot to mention this, make sure your eyebrows are, you know, shaped the way you want them, filled in the way you want them, all that good stuff, so then you could just start off with the look. Um, so tweeze any hairs that you don't want or, you know, whatever you do. Alright, so some of the hair will look a little darker, kind of like this one because of the wet look you can you can try to get in there okay the wet look from the glue stick but I think in my opinion I did pretty good and this is really weird um there's just those stubborn little hairs alright but other than that, this is it. This is all you, there is to the look. It's so easy, so fast, and all you need is three things. Now, I'm not, um, you're probably wondering why I'm not doing an old face look. I might eventually, but right now, um, I just came up with the idea for the eyebrows, and I don't really know what to do for the rest of the face. Um, I might do it someday, though. I'll zoom you guys out, and yeah. Alright, so here it is. Um, to you, they may look like old eyebrows, or they may just look like really light eyebrows, but I think because of the white mixing with my natural eyebrow color that it makes them look, 
you know, gray and old and, you know. This one looks a little better, in my opinion. But I think, like, looking at it, I, I you know, I'm looking at myself in the screen and it does look older. I look a little older, in my opinion, than I usually do. So, um, you know, I hope this helps someone. You may have needed it for Halloween or, you know, just for fun. Whatever it is, you know, maybe you do theater. Um, so I hope this helped you. Um, rate, favorite, comment below, subscribe over there. And thanks so much for watching, and have a great day. Bye.